Okay, so I guess you're here looking for information on how to replace a thermostat in an F-150. This, what we have here, is a 95 F-150, 5-liter V8, and it's overheating. So we're going to try replacing the uh, thermostat, which is right inside here. Issues that we can see, first, let's see if we can get in here, this bolt right down here is going to be a pain to get out because well I don't know if I can reach in there to show you right there on the edge of the water pump next to this one bolt that's not going to work is a piece of aluminum that's sticking out just far enough to block access to that bolt with a socket. So that's going to be an issue. First thing I need to do here is remove this hose and put it out of the way. Also remove this small hose down here and get that put out of the way. And then I always like to try to do the hardest thing first just to make sure out of the way and done. I'm going to try to get that bolt out down there. And uh, from there, it should be a piece of cake. I'll uh, keep you updated as we go. Okay, got the hose off of there. That wasn't too difficult. Half inch wrench. I managed to get it on that bolt down there. And luckily, it wasn't on there too tight, but I can only turn it just a little bit. So it's going to be a while getting that off. I'm glad it went this easy. So hopefully this repair won't be so difficult. Okay. Got the housing off. Thermostat's out. It was actually a little bit harder to get that left bolt out of here. That one right there. than it was this one. But both came off still fairly easily, all things considered. There's that housing. Looks like I just need to scrape off the old gasket. Clean that surface real good. And then... Put in a new one. Gotta make sure... Keep the short side towards the radiator. Last thing you want to do is put that thing in there backwards. I don't think it'll work that way. Okay, there it is, ready for the thermostat to go in. The hardest part of this, as it turns out, was getting all that old gasket material off of there. That yeah, was kind of difficult, just getting in there. I used a uh, box cutter blade. Let me show that to you if I can find it here. Yeah. I used a box cutter blade. Be very careful if you use one of those. That thing's sharp. And wire brush. Took a little while, but I eventually got it. So now I'm going to see if I can't get this reassembled. Quick note, make sure you get this right. This gasket that we got, we had to buy that separate. It's sticky on one side. You peel this paper off of it. And it'll stick real nice on there so you don't have to worry about keeping it in place while you're sticking the bolts back in but you got to remember put that thermostat in first because it sits on a groove on the inside of there and this actually holds it in place also so one of those things you don't want to forget otherwise you have to try to peel that off and once it's on there it wants to stay okay it's all back in put together again make sure you put that thermostat in the right way short end goes towards the radiator or towards this hose right here which which does go to the radiator not too bad of a job. I got dirty. But hopefully this will work. Thanks for watching. Make sure you uh, like, comment, ask questions. I'll, uh, I'll check every day to see if anybody's asked and help you all I can. Take care.